Okay, let's go through uh, the draw for the WTA 500 event in Sydney next week. So big draw in Sydney, big uh, tournament in Sydney for the WTA. It's got a lot of big names playing, of course. Uh, we'll go through that in just a second, but also some big names are not playing this event and are pulled out late. So let's go to the withdrawal list. Some big names, some key names. So Fernandez, she's pulled out from what we're hearing is maybe a back problem. Kerber, she's not playing. Pavlyuchenkova also not playing. And Sakari also pulled out of Sydney. So four big names that are pulled out of the event. Four top 25 players that are not playing next week. Here is the draw for the WTA 500 event. And Ash Barty. She's the top seed. We've got uh, eight seeds in this one. Top four, uh, top two seeds get a buy in the first round. Barty gets a buy in the first round. Uh, she'll play the winner of Hon or Christian, who are going at it in the first round. Then we've got Pagula versus Garcia. Winner of that plays, no doubt, the biggest match in the of the day of the year so far. Raducanu takes on the number six seed, Sviantec. That is massive. Sviantec, Raducanu, what are you talking about? Uh, then we've got Contivate, the number four seed, taking on Zhang. She hasn't played yet uh, Contivate in this season, so first time we're seeing her. Winner of that match plays a qualifier in the second round because two qualifiers are going at it. Then we've got, Col uh, then we've got Kvitova versus Rus. Winner of that match takes on either Sharma or the number seven seed, Jabor, in the second round. Then we've got the number five seed, Bedosa versus Ostapenko. Winner of that match takes on either Tomjanovic or a qualifier in the second round. Then we've got two qualifiers going at it again. The winner of that qualifier battle will take on another blockbuster first round. Either Belinda Bencic, who we haven't seen for a while, had COVID a couple of weeks ago, taking on the number three seed, Krejcikova, in the first round, who again, first time we're seeing her in 2021 or 2022. So massive matchup there. Then we've got the number eight seed, uh, Kennan, taking on Kazakina. Winner of that match takes on either a qualifier or Mertens in the second round. Then we've got Rabakina versus Alexandrova. Winner of that match takes on the number two seed, Muguruza. And I'll tell you what, I told you this was stacked. I told you there was dangerous unseeded players all over the place, and it's played out the way that we expected. Who wins this? That's what I want to know. I mean, Sviantec, Barty, they're in good form. Muguruza, first time we're seeing her. Uh, maybe she can continue her 2021 end of season form. Or is it going to be someone like a Jabor or Krejcikova or Kennan or... Uh, Contivate. Uh, it's so crazy. This is a crazy tournament, especially leading into the Australian Open. It's a mini slam. We're only missing a couple of key players, but it's huge in Sydney. So let me know in the comments. Let me know in the chat. Who do you think is going to win this event? Man, what an event.